This is kind of a random video. So, if you guys don't know, um, I recorded a video, I think I believe it, yeah, it was yesterday, and I didn't upload it. But it was about me and me smoking cigars because I smoke cigars more rarely than occasionally. You know, I'll have one maybe four every three weeks or two to three every two weeks. You know, it, or, and you're, normally it's two to three every three weeks. And I've been doing this for like two months. So, and really I, I picked up on doing that the two to three week, two to three uh, every two weeks. I don't know. Um, like three weeks ago. So I haven't even been doing two to three every three weeks for two months. It's been like three weeks since I've been, or a month maybe that I've been doing that. Um, so not, I've not had many at all. I've maybe had like 14 cigars in two months, which maybe some people consider, cons consider that to be, um, quite a bit. I don't know, but this is, as you can see by the title of the video, terminologies that I hate when people are talking about cigars. It's not meant to be a negative video. I thoroughly enjoy cigars. I just want to talk about the incorrect um, terminology and things that people say when they're describing the flavor of cigars. I went into two humidors by now um, and have been to the, the, same, the one of the humidors about four times and then the other one in Avon near where I live in Indiana I've been to uh, first time today and I ask everyone I say I'm looking for the sweetest cigar you have and I'm talking about actually sweet. When the smoke comes into my mouth, sorry, the overexposure. I know the sun's going crazy right now. When I, I ask for the sweetest cigar, and I'm ta not talking about a sweetened cap, I'm talking about like the smoke is sweet, which you can get, I suppose, not really with a sugar, an actual sugar content in a cigar. But when I ask for a sweet cigar, I'm obviously asking the person, I want something flavor infused or not where the smoke tastes sweet. I don't want flavors that our brain know to be sweet. Like, you know, you get a citrus, citrusy hint, or you get cherry, this cherry flavor. And it's that taste, even though it has no sugar in it, it's just the taste that we associate with uh, sweetness. And I had a cigar today that a guy recommended me, which is, he, uh, was, is to be known as one of the sweetest and creamiest Cigars. It's a uh, Baccarat or Baccarat. I don't know how you say it. The damn thing wasn't sweet. When you describe things, at least be accurate in what you're describing because there's no such thing as a creamy cigar. There is no such thing as a as a as a as a super sweet cigar unless you're buying cigarellos. If you're buying a true authentic cigar, chances are you're not going to be getting a a a, 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 a real true sweetness from an authentic hand-rolled high-quality cigar you're never gonna get sweetness from a, a, a beautifully crafted hand-rolled cigar you just don't you get a sweetened cap and you'll get flavors not an actual sugar sweetness but flavors that you can associate that your brain knows to be sweet say that someone sprays a, 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 some sort of uh, flavor in your mouth or something and it's that has no sugar in it whatsoever, no no fake sweeteners, no sugar. It's just the taste of what we associate to be sweet. Spray cherry, orange, um, vanilla flavor in your mouth. You know, like what I'm saying is take a drop or two of um, vanilla extract, put it on your tongue. We associate that actual taste to be sweet, but there's no sugar in vanilla extract is what I'm getting at. So when people tell me that I, when I ask for a sweet cigar... Um, I'm asking for something that actually has um, sugar. Like the tobacco is naturally sweet. You smoke it, the, the smoke tastes sweet. I had a, um, I, think, I believe it's called a Don Rafa cigar. It was a uh, cherry cognac. That thing was actually sweet. It legitimately was. The smoke was fairly sweet. I was enjoying this very nice, very mellow sweet cigar. You know, of course, the cherry cognac flavor, the cherry flavor, I associate that with sweetness, so my brain kind of makes me think it's sweet. But at the same time, there was genuine sweetness in the tobacco, and on the cap, uh, it was uh, a sugar-dipped cap, which is what you put in your mouth if you don't know what I'm talking about. The uh, tip of the, the, the back of the cigar, where you, sm uh, where you uh, inhale, or you bring the smoke into your mouth. It was a sugar-dipped cap, uh, and a cherry cognac flavor, um, 
cigar and it was absolutely amazing by far my favorite if you ever have the chance you come across a Don Rafa cigar oh my gosh so good now that might not be for everyone some people like the more full body full bodied cigars let me bring this closer there we go um again sorry for the exposure the sun is crazy bright but what 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 really agitates me is when I see all these people that recommend sweet cigars and then I go to buy them I, I go to a, my local humidor cigar shop I go to buy them and they're not sweet at all barely even a, a, a I had a um, uh, like I said a, a baccarat which I was looking forward to they said it was super creamy and sweet and tastes like the eight nine dollar gas station cigar I had a real authentic cigar that I got from a gas station they taste the same it's another thing I wanted to go over um, people often say that at first when you first start smoking cigars all cigars taste the same well I've been doing it for nearly two months now and you know if you want to really force yourself and, and trick your brain into finding flavors that are very hard to find in a cigar I guess you could do it because I was watching a video while I was smoking a cigar today and it was I was watching a video on cigars and someone said vanilla and when I was smoking my cigar instantly I started to taste vanilla but it was very faint and I kind of made up the flavor uh, from the smoke my brain tricked me so when people say that all cigars when cigars uh, a lot of cigars no cigar tastes the same as another complete lie of course there are cigars that don't taste the same uh, as others I've had many cigars that taste mildly uh, variously drastically different than any cigar I've had I'm just saying that if it's not flavor infused it's not sweet if there's no if it's just a you know it has wrapper uh, tobacco and water just natural and high quality hand rolled cigar they all do taste the same pretty much you're not I mean you might be picking out different flavors here and there but really what difference is the intensity of the cigar um, the the gauge how thick or, or thin it is that's really it. The flavors, you might pick up different notes here and there, but I don't smoke a cigar for notes. If I, I want the damn thing to taste different, if if it's going to taste different, I want the damn cigar to taste different than any other. I don't want it to taste the same. I just buy the cheapest that tastes the same as, a, as an Arturo Fuente, uh, Fuente cigar, which is a Cuban cigar. I had one of those yesterday. Everyone raves about them and says they're the, the, the nicest thing and they're, they're so great. Meh. It tasted the exact same as a gas station cigar, which again, it was a real hand rolled authentic cigar that my uh, that my local uh, gas station near here happens to sell. They tasted the same. In fact, I enjoy the gas station ones more than I do the Art Arturo Fuentes. Um, it's just personal preference. Again, this is not a hate video. I, I enjoy cigars. There are some really good cigars out there. Um, damn, this exposure is horrible. Uh, this, look at that upside down video. Uh, anyway, you know, I mean, are cigars like different varieties and trying different cigars? Is it overhyped? Absolutely, because really, they do taste the same. I mean, they, they really do. You're not going to find much different flavor profiles besides maybe just notes here and there. And if you get a sweetened cap, it'll kind of change the way it, you know, it, it might change the way you think about it, the flavors just a little bit. But an Arturo Fuente tastes the same as an $8 cigar. Uh, that I got at my that I that I the, actually my first cigar ever that I had at a, that I got from my local gas station tastes the same as an Arturo Fuente. Go with the cheap stuff, really. I mean, you know, you'll hear people. Oh, the more you, the more you try cigars, you'll eventually develop it, and they'll taste different. And, and they don't. It, it's a lie. They taste the same. They all do, except then you get flavor infused or you get um, really intense versus not so intense kind of mellow then you know it'll taste a little different and of course there are cigars like i said that do taste way different than other cigars but the majority of non-flavor infused regular cigars with you know if you're buying two with the same intensity and wrapper they're gonna taste the same they do so i hope you like this short little video if you did like comment subscribe sorry for the absolutely horrible lighting and i will see you guys in the next video